Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Cassandra here and today, today we have a super exciting video. We are opening constellation boxes from Alavila. And this time around, I was so surprised because if you guys scroll through my videos, I have done an unboxing twice before. And this one is a brand new box that they uh, were so kind to send to me. And I'll show you the first one that I've opened. I think the most exciting thing is if you guys look up, it's I'm hoping that it's not too hot, but basically it's a cute little tea light hoard holder and it has like, this one is for my zodiac sign, which is a cancer. How pretty. Let's just have her in the background. So I'll show you what came in in that first box and I'll show you all the other ones. So for comparison, let's just start with, they all come in packaged like this. Then when you open it, they are, so I will literally open up a brand new box for you. Pray that I don't cut myself. That would be great. And there we are. Oh, one more side. So when you open it, it comes up uh, like this. So then you take your little foam out. Again, it has wrapping all around. And it's also wrapped in foil. So even if it falls out, which it wouldn't because you're taking it out from the box and it's still covered up. Then there is more goodies at the bottom. And that's the box. So this is a Pisces box this time around. And this is the previous one. Can we just see how much bigger the new boxes are? So that was the old one that came in. The old ones came in with a little card. It came with five crystals. And that was kind of it. It had little um, details about your zodiac sign and all about the crystals. This time around, it comes in in a massive box. So this is Pisces. This is a zodiac sign of my fiance, actually. So maybe I could give it to him. But I'll just put it in the living room so he can enjoy it more. By the way, if I look a little freaked out because I'm sitting by open doors, so I'm hoping there's no cats coming in from the outside. So after I unwrap this, you open it up. And it comes in what the old one came with, which you have a little greeting card. Ooh. That's the little greeting card that it comes with. The constellation for Pisces. It talks about everything that has to do with Pisces. And it comes with a crystal zodiac book, which if you open it to any page, it kind of has the zodiac sign and all of the breakdown of which crystal as well for the specific zodiac sign which i thought was really cute you could give this to someone if they wanted to start their crystal collection which i thought that was great then it comes with the little bag that you can put all of your crystals in or just use for anything else again it has all of the names of the crystals on the top it comes in with another layer of packaging which i think is so great because a lot of the time crystal can damage very very easily so it comes in with its own little tea light, like I showed you guys before for the Cancer. And it comes with every single one. Um, has six plus selenite wand. And it describes everything that it has. So from amethyst, clear quartz. Um, it has the Pisces candle holder, uh, labradorite, kyanite, tiger's eye, green fluorite, and selenite stick. It also tells you exactly what each crystal is for, which I love this. And it's a mix between polished crystals, so that's the tiger's eye, and then raw crystals, which, oh, how pretty is this? Like, this purple is so pretty, and that's amethyst. So, for Pisces, amethyst means it's a energy, vibration, um, Pisces peace, love, and happiness em embraces, enhances the Pisces spiritual life. So, I think that's great. So, this is what it does for a Pisces clear quartz, stone of the power, amplifies any energy and intention. So great if you are manifesting or if you journal or you just want to feel better, that would be great for you. If you're Pisces, labradorite. So this helps banish fears and insecurities. So if you have a Pisces in your life that's maybe a little insecure about either one thing or just in general, great one to give them. I don't even know if I have this one. Kyanite helps with communication issues and aids in repairing relationships. So, you know, if you have a boyfriend, fiance, or a husband that's a Pisces, 
slide this into his car, you know, so he can communicate with you exactly how he needs to. Green fluoride, it helps mind to stay awake, deepens thinking ability and helps Pisces solve complex issues. Again, great to leave on your desk or have it at your workplace and like in a drawer or in your briefcase and tiger's eye, which is the one that's polished and uh, promotes wealth and luck, encourages Pisces to live bravely in all aspects of their life. How cute is that? I think the difference in book size is fantastic. Also, you can use this for so much more actually to store all of your crystals, for example. So this is great. This is the difference between the old and the new one. And obviously the little tea light is so pretty. And I think it's, I'm going to put all of them up on my little shelf. I think that's going to look really, really cute. Also, at the bottom of our little box, we have a little Pisces card. First of all, how pretty is the art? I do not know who designs the art for them, but it says... Pisces, listening to music and overthinking life. So it's like a little funky quote about Pisces. Then it comes with a crystal zodiacs, which I already have one open, so I'll show you guys. So the books comes with basically every zodiac sign, and it talks about their personalities, strengths, weaknesses, uh, love and romance, career, family and friends, and the crystals for that particular sign. I think that is, again, such a good thing that you can share with your friends or, you know, just have for yourself. And again, the art in here is great. So highly recommend. And then it comes with a little note. It's like a, almost like a little birthday card. And it says, wishing you a million good things. So pretty. And I'm pretty sure that's the same art that's on the little Pisces card. But yeah. That is so pretty. So that was our Pisces box. Let me move this out of the way. So for the cancer box, we have, as I showed you guys, let me bring it closer again. Open it up. The box now, the constellation box, actually comes with a tea light holder, which, how cute is that? So I already popped in a candle, and this one is for my zodiac sign. Don't know if you guys will be able to pick up how cute the design is, but I'm gonna pop it on the back so I don't, so I don't drop it. And again, it comes with six crystals and a selenite wand. So it comes with green adventurine, which is positivity stone, um for prosperity encourages cancer to embrace change growth and renewal carnelian which gives cancer courage to promote positive life choices and motiv motivates them for success labradorite balances and protects aura raises consciousness and grounds in spiritual energies which again i do have a bracelet um as well then we have rose quartz which i feel like rose quartz is like a ride or die for cancer and it's all about self-love and promoting loving energies we have a clear quartz which it's all about purity power cleansing love it and emphasize any other crystal you have it with and we have that green fluoride has strong energy it helps with concentration and self-confidence which i'm gonna i'm pretty sure put it in my car so it helps me with driving and speaking of that Every single box comes with a little pouch. So if you wanted to pop it somewhere, I can just pop this and say so I can put it in my car like this. So I can just have it with me at all times to help me with my concentration and confidence, which I think that's really sweet. And, and again, it comes with all the goodies, which is a little stay healthy card, your little constellation, constellation card for cancer. So it talks about the birthdays, it talks which um, planets it aligns with, what elements are you with, what planet rules it, little cancer response best when treated like royalty. And I mean, as a cancer, I might have to say they're right. Um, and then it says, wishing you, wishing a million good things for you. So sweet, that is so pretty. Comes with the little zodiac and crystal book. And it comes with a little card, which I already showed you. And like every other one, it comes in with the book, which talks about every single zodiac, which if you guys wanted me to talk about it, I could read those out to you. 
maybe on the next video. It talks about, for example, cancer's personality. Family values and traditions mean a lot to a water sign, especially with their mothers. Even if they don't have a good relationship, they feel heavily affected by their family. To a cancer, blood, blood is thicker than water. If they have a great relationship with their family, they may hold this dear to them. Same way, as a crab carries their home everywhere, they go. Cancers are home buddies, which I salute to that. Um, and then a motto for, motto for cancer is, I feel, therefore I am. And to be fair, nail on the head but i already said before that i am definitely a cancer baby and my moon is in leo which definitely shows so the next constellation box is for leo and again i can't get over the size difference i just think that's fantastic you know they really upgraded it and i think you can store so much more in the bigger ones so leo yet again comes in packed like this which is so pretty so we have our little welcome card, constellation card for Leo. So it talks about the elements. Ruling planet is the sun. Symbol is the lion. Lucky number is eight and nine. And all those other goodies. I'm not going to spoil it for whoever wants to have it as a surprise. Red Jasper absorbs negative energy, aligning Leo's body, mind, and spirit. Then we have Garnet, which stabilizes their mood, reduces unnecessarily troubles called, caused by carelessness carelessness which to be fair that's not often me unless we are talking about attitude and speaking our mind then we have clear quartz which is here and it's a master healer amplified the energy of any other crystal like mentioned before then we have a citrine which helps to overcome depression for leo and it helps with communication which again maybe i should just pop it in and keep it with me at all times tiger's eye which again so nice and this is so cute it's like a little rectangular rectangular one uh, but polished so it helps with clarity and understanding of selves and we have the last one which is a carnelian and this is a stone of passion i feel like it looks like a sacral chakra that's the color that i would imagine it to be it helps with being bold courageous passionate and ambitious in nature and then again it comes with oh, selenite stick and they all come in and a nice flat packaging uh, packaging shape um and again comes with the little tea light which this is so pretty like i am so excited to put all of them up it's just going to be the next box we have for the constellation boxes is the scorpio one and let me know if you have a Scorpio in your family because I feel sorry for you. Um, so, sorry to all the Scorpios. I know that you guys are going to have an argument in the comments down below. And, you know, again, it comes in with a little stay healthy, be happy note. It talks about all of the constellation and talks all about the zodiac sign on a cute little card, which I think if you were into crystals and you're collecting it, it's so cute to have. Then it comes with the little book talking about every um, crystal that you have and also talks about you can even go to Alvila's website and get all of this online so you could have on your phone on a go or on the laptop. A little pouch to put your crystals in and then we have the crystals inside. So first and foremost, let me pop this in. So if you guys can see all the little gold bulbs behind me, they're all from all the other constellations. I just thought I would light them up and show you how they look. But then let me light this one and bring it closer. I don't know how well my camera is going to pick this up, but the art on those is spectacular. Whoever did this, first of all, props to you for having such a good eyesight. But this is so beautiful. So I am going to pop this on the shelf just in the background. And they all you can actually see which sign is which on which um wow those are the witches on which candle holder it is and then we have our crystals i just moved my selenite wand they come in with a little divider so we have our red jasper which is a worry stone so it helps to um work with negativity and calm down our scorpios citrine it helps with imagination and creativity and that one is so pretty it almost looks like an eye shape to be fair 
very small but very rich amethyst i think that one is smaller than any other box but i think is the most like deep purple um out of them all labradorite so it sell, helps scorpios facing challenges and protects them from negativity which again i do have a bracelet for that one of my favorite is black obsidian it's all grounding and it helps with negative um energy and also it helps with healing deeply emotionally but this one is almost like a see-through black which i have a bracelet i'll show you guys so no that's not the bracelet the bracelet is upstairs my one is like super dark this one is almost like see-through black i love it so pretty i'm probably not going to share those with anyone else and the last one it's So green fluoride helps Scorpios with their energy and focus. So again, it comes in this massive box is a lot bigger than the previous one. And again, it has the little card and it has the book with everything to know about every zodiac sign, which I think is a great little addition that all of this comes in one box. If you have someone who is really into crystals or astrology, that might be a good way to start or... If someone isn't and you really want to surprise them or get them into it get that one and last but not least from the boxes that i requested is a libra and again libra came in with our little notes and it says libra procrastinating but calling it self-care to be fair am i a libra you know doing two-hour skincare so funny and again comes in with everything and i think that one has such a fun has a lot of blue stones in there so again comes with our, with our little card and then constellation card talking about everything so the blue stone blue sorry the birthstone is actually blue sapphire and october is opal and pink turnal turnamine turnamine wow something new every day our little crystal book our little bag like in every other one I just caught a glimpse of how pretty this looks on the shelf. I'm so excited to add the last one onto my shelf. So in this box, actually, we have two blue stones and another love quartz. So love quartz, uh, sorry, rose quartz, obviously stone of love, helps attract and keep um, and keep love and also helps them with protecting their relationships. Blue appetite can absorb negative energy from itself or others. So in yourself if you're not feeling great or if someone around libra is negative it can help absorb that negative energy citrine it helps optimism and positive energy and that one is so pretty you can almost see through it but not really and one edge is so like sharp love that and then lapis lapis lazuli i think i had a problem with that one last time that i did the opening stimulate desire to knowledge and understanding the process of learning which again, if someone is a student or if you know you have problems at work, that would be a great Libra stone. Then we have a black obsidian, and that one is almost freaking purple. That's so pretty. It might just be reflecting the back of my light. But again, a little bit darker than the previous one in the Scorpio. That's so pretty. And the last one we have a clear quartz that helps us with positive energy and it allows them, it allows a Libra to um ease their, ease their mental fatigue which i should probably rub it all over me because that's what i need and like in every other box oh, we have our little selenite stick um which i think that's so nice and it helps to redraw negative energy and it infuses positive energy it's great for clearing your crystals and charging i think it would be great when you meditate with another crystal just popping them all in your hands or popping it on the plate with your crystals after you've meditated or have done any kind of healing rituals. So, and that is the Libra box. Next constellation box is Aries. Again, they all come in. So at the bottom of your box, they are all wrapped in this. The bottom, we have the book talking about every single zodiac sign, which crystals, what kind of traits they have, a little welcome card, and it comes with here says Aries, everyone was thinking it, I just said it, which to be fair, calling out my sister because whatever she thinks she's going to speak, which very Aries of her. 
Then we have Aries box. And again, ooh, I'm going to open it up nice and slow. Comes with our greeting card, the constellation breakdown. So elements fire, ruling planet is Mars, symbol is the Ram. Uh, lucky numbers one and nine. Birthstone is aquamarine and bloodstone. So, so cute. And then it has the little crystal book describing all the crystals for every single zodiac, not just for the one that you decided to purchase. It comes with the little pouch, which they're such a lifesaver. You can put anything, like any dried flower, and put it anywhere you want, and it's going to smell really nice. Or pack your crystals with you when you're going somewhere. And again, very secure. Comes with another one of the tea lights holders. Ooh, there we go. This is another one. The art on those, I have no clue how they did it, but it's so pretty. So, another one. I'm going to pop it back here. So, we have... So, Kyanite, it cleanses and opens up mind, helps Aries to communicate. And again, it's like a grayish baby blue, which I really like that. We have Citrine, Stone of Success, so bling, brings good luck and wealth to and Aries. Then we have clear quartz, so pure power and energy, which can make them more aware and active. That one is almost like a foggy color. Then we have opportunity stone, which is green adventuring. It helps with manifesting prosperity and wealth. I'm pretty sure that amethyst is one of my all-time favorite stones besides rose quartz, which very cancer of me. But this helps, um, vibration brings Aries peace, love, and happiness, and it helps them with their spiritual life. And this one, again, a very deep purple, which I love. And Red Jasper, it helps them think before they act, which if you guys have an Aries girl in your life, and every time there's a minor inconvenience and she goes and dyes her hair, um, get her that. Maybe get her a whole entire brick of Red Jasper because those girls need it. So maybe I should go and drive over to my sister and gift her this one. So our Aries girls are not going to ruin the hair every time a minor inconvenience comes around. Okay, guys, that is it for the constellation boxes from Alvila. I was so thankful for them to deliver that. And again, the amount of work that they put into their product and they've listened to any feedback and it's better and better every single time. So I'm going to leave all of their links and social media down below. Let me know what you would like to see next and I hope you guys enjoyed. So until the next time, I will talk to you guys soon.